Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Noelle and I do unboxings, mostly lifestyle subscription boxes, but also some stationery, books, beauty, jewelry, travel, home decor, and even the occasional dash of Disney. So if you enjoy unboxings, I hope you'll consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notification bell. And as always, if you're already subscribed, thank you so much for being here and welcome back. Today I have another jewelry roundup for you. I try to collect the different jewelry subscriptions that I receive throughout the month so that I can open them all at once so that you can compare and contrast the different offerings. A couple of them have running, been running a bit behind, so I have a couple Septembers to share with you, as well as a couple Octobers, but we'll just see how many we can get through. As always, I will leave all of the links as well as the discount codes in the description box below, and if you're lucky, I will remember to include the timestamps as well, although of course it definitely helps me out when you watch the videos in their entirety if you're interested. So let's get started with Glamour Jewelry Box. This has been sent to me for for review. Glamour Jewelry Box is fun because you get to choose if you prefer gold and rose gold pieces or silver or you can actually say if you want to have like a surprise a mixture of the two. Now I generally prefer gold. I don't usually wear a lot of rose gold and because this is sent to me for review I never know which which tone I'm going to receive so it's a little bit of a surprise a little bit of a mystery for me. The Glamour Jewelry Box actually comes in a bubble mailer, so it's more of a bag. It is $34 per month and you always receive two pieces, but if you use the code NOELLE, you will receive a third piece of jewelry for free in your first set and it will have a value of at least $25. So like I said, it always comes in a little bubble mailer and then there's usually a little postcard that tells us about the theme for the month and then there's this nice soft jewelry bag and both pieces are inside of that. So let's see what our theme is. It says, I don't like to gamble, but if there's one thing I'm willing to bet on, it's myself and we know that that is from Queen B herself so then on the other side it says this month's collection is inspired by your beauty happiness confidence these jewelry pieces are meant to empower strengthen and uplift you we hope each inspirational piece and quote brings a smile to your face okay so they had been doing um different like destinations like different vibes which I was really enjoying but this one is just like kind of all about you so let's go ahead and open it up looks like I got gold this time so it does tell us about the pieces on these little individual cards and it looks like we got a quote on the other side so I will definitely tell you about this and then each of them came in their own little bag so they didn't get tangled or anything so it looks like we have a bracelet and a pair of earrings now I don't usually wear a lot of chain bracelets like this just because they are so challenging to put on but I do like this with these little intermittent rectangular beads it does have a nice extender here with this little lobster clasp so let's read about this it is called the Horizon bracelet. It has a retail value of $38. It says dress up your bracelet stack with the Horizon bracelet. This modern bracelet features a row of sleek bars that you can wear with most stackable styles and trending looks. And then on the other side, let's see what the quote is. It says passion is energy. Feel the power that comes from focusing on what excites you. And that is from the incomparable Oprah Winfrey. And then we have another uh, item, which is the wishful earrings. So let me go ahead and pull these out. They look to be like little studs which you guys know I am not really a stud earring wearer. oh no they're even better you guys <laughs> they were deceptive so they kind of have a stud backing but then they get way cooler and way more me because they have this nice chain drop with a nice rod on the bottom so I love how this does sort of mimic the bracelet it definitely has the same style so you could wear them together or apart but these are totally something that I would wear I actually even have a pair of threader earrings that is very very similar to these wish earrings so let's see what it says about these I love them I almost wish they were even more dramatic but what's great about these is they're gonna give you a little bit of length but they're very very lightweight so it says the wishful earrings are sleek and delicate making it a perfect seasonal pair the minimalist design adds a subtle touch to your look and will provide an effortless touch to kickstart any autumn celebration these have a retail value of $36 very simple very sleek let's read the quote on the other side to fall in love with yourself is the first secret to happiness, and that is from Robert Morley. So I love those earrings. I will definitely be wearing these um, all the time, probably not just for fall. So let's move on to our next set of jewelry, which comes from Mint Mongoose, which also comes in a bubble mailer. I even have the bubble mailers. So this is what my Glamour Jewelry Box came in, or jewelry bag, and this is what my Mint Mongoose one came in. Now, Mint Mongoose often includes a little Werther's Original in there, 
there for a little sweet treat. And they are only $16.99 and they have all kinds of fun add-on options as well for three pieces of jewelry and you get to tell them if you like silver, rose gold, or gold. And you can always move back and forth between the different jewelry tones, which I really like because they often do spoilers over on Instagram. So when you see one of the items, you can kind of decide if you think it looks better in whichever tone. So I usually just say gold. I usually just leave it at gold. This has also been sent to me for a review, but they do let me make that preference known. Now, if you use the code NOEL50, you can save 50% on your first set, you guys. So that's like half off of already just $16.99, which I think is pretty awesome. And then inside of the bubble mailer, we have our little envelope with a little mint mongoose. And then we have a nice postcard. This kind of looks like a fun road trip to me. And then on the other side, it tells us all about the inspiration. So let's go ahead and read a little bit says, hi, this month's set is inspired by the fun to be had when you go outside and enjoy the world around you. Indeed, just got back from a road trip. Didn't have those uh, beautiful mountains and greenery that's shown in that image, but definitely a fun road trip. I love going road tripping with my hubby. says, my family and I recently developed a love for road trips. And then you have this nice little uh, tissue paper inside. It says, we've been making our way to visit family and see new things that the kids have never before seen. It's been a blast and honestly, I wonder why I didn't give it a go sooner. I was really missing out. On one of our trips, we drove up the to the Washington, Oregon area, which is actually where my dad's uh, side of the family is from, and it is gorgeous, you guys. Some of the hikes and stuff that you can do in the summer months up there are amazing. It says, uh, I'm not sure how many of you are familiar with that stretch, but there's a big chunk of the journey that is vast desert above 100 degrees. Despite the heat, we had a blast playing the ABC game, find every letter of the alphabet outside the car, and the first one done wins playing peekaboo with the baby and exploring off ramps in the middle of nowhere. As a young girl, I was always nervous about the dark, but it wasn't until a near death experience in my high school years that my fear found justification. It needed to torment. You know what? I think this is a, I think that's actually a paragraph that didn't get a cut from the uh, last time around, which was about fear and facing it. It says the heat of these trips took a backseat to the positivity, laughs and adventures. The long layer of this set is meant to represent the fun of getting out and about, even if in your car. Um, the shorter length necklace is meant to represent the fun adventures we had throughout the trip, stopping at gas stations and taking detours just because I have to say, I love the gas station stops. I always like to get, you know, some like road trip junk food. And we had such good luck in terms of the little like cafes and diners that we stopped in on our road trip and they were always awesome. And we just love one of the things about road trips is so cool is meeting other people. We got to talk to such interesting people. I met like a professional photographer. Um, we met these awesome couples that travel all the time. We met a pair of sisters that were like sleeping in their car and I just love those like conversations you know they're not necessarily like gonna keep in touch with these people just having that like interaction especially after last year was really really delightful so it says, I hope that this set inspires you to get outdoors and see new things, whether that be from the comfort of your car and taking a stroll in your own neighborhood. Adding some sun and different scenery to your day is always good. Happy adventuring. So now we can get into the set. So they do show us the images so you can kind of see what they look like in the different colors, but each of the pieces comes in its own little plastic bag. So that's what all that noise was and why I was going ahead and trying to read at the same time. That's why I didn't catch that little errant uh, paragraph that was still stuck in there. So here is what it looks looks like. I think this might be the longer one. Now, to be honest with you, I don't wear longer necklaces, especially when they have like a really dainty little pendant on them. But I do like that Mint Mongoose always has a nice extender chain with the extender chain with the intermittent. It's like about an inch, uh, maybe an inch and a quarter apart. And then they have their little like Mint Mongoose emblem there at the bottom. And then they always use this kind of thicker chain weight. I do wish there was a little bit more variation in terms of the chain weight, especially on the shorter, really delicate necklaces. I would like a thinner um, chain but this is really pretty I love it because it looks like a compass and I'm all about all things that look like compasses because I do have that spirit of wanderlust and I love to travel so there you can kind of see it so this is an example of where it is a very long chain but I just think that that little dainty pendant would be so much sweeter on a shorter chain and then it's kind of hard because the way that they create these because they are all made in-house they're all designed by Helena which I think is so amazing um, that she runs this company designed all of this jewelry 
but um, it's a little bit difficult to take that pendant off. You would actually have to use pliers to go ahead and get that off. So then each of the uh, sets, they always sort of complement one another. I'm trying to get into this next necklace, which is the shorter one. So of course you can layer. I usually, like I said, I usually only wear the shorter ones and I wish that I could uh, interchange them a little bit more. So this kind of has a very similar vibes to that bracelet from Glamour Jewelry Box in terms of having these little rods intermittently placed. I love this. It's a very simple chain. I've been wearing more chains that don't have pendants on them. It's a really good every day. And even the chain itself feels a little bit more fine than the chains that the pendant necklaces usually come with. So I am liking this. I kind of wish that I could take that pendant from the longer chain and put it onto this one. I think that would actually look really good paired together in one piece. But that's probably going to be my favorite piece because lately the earrings they've been doing have been very, very dainty, which I know that makes sense in terms of appealing to more people. Um, you can do no earrings as an option for most of these subscriptions, including Mint Mongoose. So the earrings are just these little hook earrings that just match the pendant on that longer chain. So um, not ones that I would probably wear that much just because they aren't dangly and big enough for me because you guys know I like to wear my big earrings. They're pretty cute um, and I think you might be able to do something else with them if you're very creative in terms of using them as charms. But um, I'm definitely loving the idea of the compass pendants, but maybe I would have like worn it more if it was like a short little a short little chain. So let's put that one off to the side. I thought that was a nice one. I and I did like it in in the gold or in the silver in this case or the rose gold. So now let's talk about your bijou box. So both of those, the glamour jewelry box as well as the Mink Mongoose, those were their September collections. This one from your bijou box. It's the second time I've had the opportunity to share this box with you here on the channel, and it is their October set. Now your bijou box always includes three pieces as well and you get to choose if you want just silver tone pieces or you can say you like a mixture of silver and gold so I think sometimes they're available in gold. Um, for example last time the last set I think only came in the silver. This collection is $49.99 per month but if you use the code Noel Sparkle you can get a free piece in your first set. What I think is really fun about this subscription though is that it always includes a fun accessory to go along Along with your jewelry pieces so let's go ahead and take a look and uh, it comes in this nice little like collectible jewelry box which I think is so pretty I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with them if I wind up with a lot but I do think they'd be so great for re-gifting and I do a lot of re-gifting of jewelry pieces that I receive as well as other fun things you could even put like little skincare items in here and then inside of there sometimes they manage to put the accessory in there this time it was a little bit bigger so it came in an outside mailer and then inside is your little jewelry pouch so here is our card that tells us about this this month's uh, set. It says Bloom Baby Bloom. She's got bubbles and sunflowers. That looks super duper fun. So it says, hey beauty, uh, this is the October collection. It's the sunflower collection. It has an over $200 value, which that's crazy. So it is in either 18 karat uh, gold or sterling silver plate. It says, when I was young, my family moved to Minnesota briefly, and this was my first experience with the sunflower field. I was amazed. They were so beautiful. Giant sunflowers as far as the eye could see and always moving towards the sun. They made a big impression on me, and I've loved them ever since. I hope this collection gives you the same vibes super cool you guys so you can also tell them uh, if you prefer to not have earrings and so I think sometimes you might get a ring instead so I'm gonna try to open these up man they are really really sealed shut so let me see I might have to sneak in with my scissors on these little bags so each of them came in their own little bag within this cute little pouch which is really good in terms of keeping your jewelry nice and bright I'm trying to get the ring out. So the rings are all adjustable as far as I have noticed so far. And this is really simple. Oh, this is pretty. So it's a sunflower. You probably guessed from the uh, name of the set of the... Uh of this beautiful design or collection and then it's got these really pretty little stones sparklies in the center of it so it says you will smile every time you look down at your finger at this cz encrusted sunflower ring adjustable to wear on any finger i will definitely take some photos for you guys over on instagram i'll have to see if i can get my hands on some sunflowers but i've had some bad luck lately with keeping my sunflowers from drooping so that is really really pretty and i love the gold and i love the subtle sparkle so that's a great piece to start with and then I think we're gonna get more of that same sort of pendant um, on the other pieces so the next one is a necklace which now I'm also gonna have to struggle to get this open let me see if I can use my use my fingernails to get in there hopefully 
All right, you guys. So they do a nice job of making sure that it doesn't get tangled because it came in like this longer bag. But now, of course, I can't get into the longer bag. Here we go. So what's really cool about her designs is they always have these easy pull clasps. So you don't have to worry about uh, messing around with them at the nape of your neck. You don't have to worry about uh, not being able to get a bracelet on. And then what's super cool about them is then they have this nice adjustable length. So you don't have to be stuck with having it as a super long necklace. You can do it as short as you want. So, and I've even seen people do really cool things where they actually wear it like backwards with like a backless top or dress. And that looks really really stunning and very very sexy so this has like a kind of a thicker chain because it's got this beautiful sunflower again here at the center so it says a constant reminder to keep your face to the sun wear with a fall color dress or a white t-shirt blue jeans and a pair of simple kids don't forget to swing the mm, this is our accessory over your shoulders or around your neck so simple and chic designed with a slider closure for perfect perfect placement and ease of use. So, so great, you guys. You just put it over your head. That's why you get that nice long length and I will totally be rocking this sunflower necklace, which is like just a little bit bigger, it looks like, than the ring. So com comparing the two, you can see that that one is just a little bit bigger. Sorry if it's not focusing, you guys. And then we finally have some earrings. Now these are like smaller earrings. Again, sort of like the, uh, the last set of earrings that I showed you from the other box. So these probably won't get worn by me quite a bit because I like my bigger earrings. I probably would have worn them if they were on like a longer chain. These would be really great as the end of a like threader earring. So let me see, it says, uh, twinkly sunflowers will pop against your locks, lightweight while still making a statement, add a pumpkin spice latte for a full fall immersion. So here is what they look like. So it's just the same sunflowers there as earrings, which they would definitely show up because they have the sparkles. I think this one is actually the same size as the ring, so they are. So the, the necklace pendant was a little bit bigger, which is kind of fun because I think it will look nice um, then as a longer necklace as well, if you did want to wear it like on the outside if you had like a higher neckline and you just had like a simple simple top on like they suggested that white t-shirt could look really cool so again let me see if I can show you I had it backwards of course and then we will get to our accessory that she alluded to as well so this time our fun accessory was a spice colored buffalo plaid scarf. It says this one is warm and cozy with all the fall vibes. So I'm feeling the whole look. So it did come with this nice ca um, card that says how to wear. So you can kind of drape it. You can almost make it look like a shirt or um, you can make it a little bit more like a kind of hipster. So it's a square. It's a big square and I feel like it's a nice silky acrylic. So it's not super wooly. It's not going to leave like lint all over your black shirt, which is good for me. So this one is actually really pretty. It's kind of got this tan color. It almost has like an olive tinge to it. There's some pink stripes in there. And then these darker ones are actually, they look to be navy and not black, even though they might be showing up as black. It just has this like rough edge along uh, the sides, which I don't mind just because um, I prefer that to tassels, but it is pretty big. So this is it all the way to the other end. So you could definitely kind of create a look um, and it's definitely going to give you some warmth as well. So it's about time for most of us to start uh, thinking about going to the pumpkin patches if you haven't already gone out there. I haven't had very good luck lately with my pumpkins. Um, not uh, totally mildewing like immediately, but you can definitely do a fun look with this. Um, I like to wear scarves and this one is a nice soft one, like I said. So you can always just kind of like loop them over your bag straps for during the day. And then when it gets a little bit colder in the evening, this looks super cute, like peeking out of the top of your denim jacket or whatever jacket that you have. And it does kind of dress things up and make you feel like you're a little bit more fall chic. So let me know what you guys thought about all of these boxes, what your favorite collection was, what your favorite piece was. I just love that uh, your Bijou box includes a fun accessory like this. And I, even though sunflowers aren't necessarily like my favorite flower, I think the execution of this set in this collection is really pretty. The ring is actually probably my favorite and what I will wear the most just because it's so easy to throw on and adjust to any finger. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you like seeing a bunch of jewelry boxes opened at the same time like this and hopefully I will see you all very, very soon in my next unboxing.